in order to go game. Hello and welcome to We're On Our Way at the Euros. I'm Helen Evans and I'll be coming to you right from the heart of the Northern Ireland camp here in Southampton. We'll be catching up with players and fans during our games at the UEFA Women's Euros and giving away plenty of prizes along the way too. For now though, let's go meet some players. Nadine and Jolie, welcome to the show. For anyone watching who's not sure what team you play for, give us a little fact file about each of you. Nadine, we'll start with you. Age, club, position. Age, <laughs> 31, um, midfield, and I play for Glen Torn. And yourself, Jolie? Um, I'm 20, centre mid, and Glen Torn. Girls, how has it been? the last couple of days. We're just soaking in the, the whole experience and, and just really trying to embrace it. Um, um, yeah, we're just getting focused now and ready for the first game. The thing is, you've been building up for this moment for so long. Was it a bit hard to take in when you were on that flight on the way thinking this is actually it? Yeah, it was crazy. I think like we've been talking about it for like yeah. a year and a half, all the Euros, Euros. And, you know, like now we're finally here. It was Ma getting on the plane, you know, we stepped off the plane straight onto the bus. So, like with said, Northern Ireland on the side of it, like it was, it was all a bit surreal. But yeah, we're just trying to take it all in at the minute. We did see the lovely suits that you had on, signage at the airport. All the support was there, and girls, you looked absolutely great. Let's take a quick look at your trip over here to Southampton. What kind of coffee do you have? Hi Julie. Hi Jackie. <laughs> Hi Reba. Hi Jackie. <laughs> we are cracking them stunning. All the good stuff. Actually, I'm worried that you actually have it. <laughs> Sorry, it's going for water. <laughs> So who had that camera there? Simone, Simone. I think Simone. as well. Jackie had it at some yeah. stage. <laughs> Everyone had a go on. Have you seen any of that footage back? No. no. Oh, it's first brilliant time. watching it, isn't it? Yeah. And as I said before, the airport supporting you, they had signs up for you. Obviously, you know, you're excited leaving Belfast, arriving at Southampton, but there has to be an element of calmness too. No, I think everyone's just buzzing off each other and um, that's what our squad's about. You know, we are one big family and it's been like that, obviously, from Kenny's been in and, and the girls have been together so long that, you know, we just really enjoy each other's company but um, yeah there's a real buzz about the camp and you know it'll continue through the next how many weeks. I am wearing the new away shirt which was just released this week. What do you think? What's your first impressions? I really like it. It's quite fresh. Nice if white. If you actually look closely as well which I'm sure you guys have. It's got a nice little pattern on it as well. Really, really nice. I'm sure we'll see lots of young girls and boys wearing that over the next couple of weeks. OK, girls, we are going to move on to our quick fire questions. Right. Well, you've got each got 30 seconds. Who wants to go first? Dino does. Are they the same questions? No. OK. You so you've no thinking time. Mm. No. OK, so it's a competition. It's are competition. we against each other? Yes, you're against each other. <sighs> OK. You're going to head start. Right. <laughs> so 30 seconds each. OK, Nadine, we'll start with you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. When the buzzer sounds. Go. Lazy Sunday or out and about? Lazy Sunday. Pizza or chips? Pizza. Favourite Netflix TV show? Mm, the Blacklist. Who do you text the most? In the squad? No, in general life. Oh, partner. What's the capital of England? <laughs> England. <laughs> England. I don't know what. She's laughing. England? England? <laughs> Nadine, well done. You scored four. Sorry, that was my fault. You probably could have scored more, but I made you laugh. Right, Jolie, yeah. your turn. Yeah. Cats or dogs? Dogs. Favourite place to go at the weekend? Mm. Out for coffee. Kirsty or Caitlin McGuinness? Oh, Caitlin. Sorry, Kirsty. <laughs> <laughs> you answered that too quickly. Uh, what would you name a pet giraffe? Gina. <laughs> best, best crisp flavour. <laughs> <laughs> sour cream and onion. Best crisp. Sour cream and onion. Oh, that was in time, surely. Gina! You're never going to live this time. Gina! Yeah, that was really quick. Why do you want to call Gina? Okay, Jolie, you scored five points. Well done. Gina the giraffe, that's going to go down in folklore. You know the go that day. Okay, girls, we are going to move on to our WhatsApp challenge. Nadine, you scored four. Jolie, you scored five. Nadine, because you lost, 
you have to pick one of our WhatsApp challenges out of the bag, our lovely branded Northern Ireland bag. So you pick one out and Jolie gets to decide who you direct this towards. Text the squad member that you've had a dream, you'll score at the Euros and to rate your chances of that happening out of 10. Who's good on the WhatsApp? Kirsty, she won't be at the gym. Kirsty, you're Okay, go with her then, we'll go with her. Okay, what do you think she's going to reply and say? Crown faces. <laughs> <laughs> Laughing or crying? <laughs> Laughing, crying. <laughs> oh. Okay, Nadine, pick your challenge. Oh. Ask a squad member to send you a video of the celebrations they'll do if they score at the Euros. Nadine, I love how up for this challenge you are. You really enjoying it. I can't wait. To <laughs> You're like right next. Proof. Oh, I really hope we get a reply from someone. Waiter just replied. She sniffed it out. <sighs> She did do crown faces and goes, this is your media stuff. Uh, <laughs> listen, do you know what? At least yeah. you all know each other really well that she knew that was a prank. <laughs> As Rachel replied. <laughs> Mate, I'm not just going to film myself. <laughs> Can you not repeat the rest? Please. I don't even know where we can go from here. Okay girls, moving on to our fan questions. What we want you to do is pick an image and we will listen to the questions sent in by the fans. Um, and also I must say at home, if you do have any questions, please do send them in for the following episodes. All the information will be on your screen. But for now, Jolie, we'll come to you first. Which one do you want to choose for now? Um, let's go Poppy. Poppy, let's hear what Poppy has to say. Hi, my name is Poppy and I'm in here Southampton with my dog and my dad and I'm really into ballet and music so I'm wondering do any of the players have a favourite song they play before the match? Aww. We need to find out the name of the dog by the way so he's got a little Northern Ireland shirt on I love it thank you Poppy for your question what's your, what's your answer Jolie? Before a game no, just just whatever's on the go. Julie's usually connected, so whatever Julie says goes. <laughs> do you listen to headphones, or do you all listen to sometimes music on the bus? Put your headphones in on the bus, and then when you get in the change room, put it on the speaker. Like sometimes chill ones on the bus because don't want to be too up for it. Yeah, mm -hmm. maybe with a Dermot Kelly. That's a wee bit sad though. Oh no, it's fine. And when you get in the changing room, who's in charge of the music? Julie, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Left it to the big girl. And what, what kind of choices does she have? Is she, is she good? Yeah, she's a bit of a mixture. Right. You could have Free From Desire one minute and then a wee bit of Mellow. So yeah. That's a tune, by the way. She's, she's, she's got it. <laughs> That's for Kirsty. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Poppy, for your question. Nadine, can you choose someone for us, please? I'm going to choose Miley and Bobby. Let's hear what Miley and Bobby have to say. Hi, Miley and Bobby. I like gymnastics. And I like football, and my favourite players is Gilfie Guinness and Stuart Powell, and they're the best players ever. Who wanted to know what your favourite player is? Good question. Favourite Northern Ireland player? Yeah. Stevie Davis. Okay, Julie will ask you too. Um, yeah, I'll say Davis too. Davo. Lots of fans in the room. Thank you for your questions. And don't forget, if you do have a question for any of the girls coming up on later episodes, email fan.experience at irishfa.com. All the details will be on your screen. Okay, girls, before we move on to Gawa on the Green, which I know you'll be really looking forward to, please sign this shirt. I'll, um... Do you remember the first time you signed it? Did your signature for a fan? No, it probably wasn't a signature. It was probably just block letters. <laughs> yeah, your name, <laughs> Jay. <laughs> Thank you so much, girls. So we'll be giving that away in a couple of weeks' time. So do stay tuned for that and please enter the competition. Girls, now it's time for Gawa on the green. Let's go. <laughs> 
you know the go go game. We've come outside for our next challenge, which is called Gawa on the Green. See what we did there? We have little golf balls with the Northern Ireland badge on them. Absolutely love that. And our little flag says Gawa on it too. So girls, what I want you to do is take six putts each. If you get two, then Poppy gets a sticker book. If you get three, Poppy will get a goodie bag full of Northern Ireland merchandise. And same for you, Nadine. Miley and Bobby can win prizes too. And also, it's a chance to be on the leaderboard for our Gawa on the green game. I know you have a bit of an advantage, which Nadine's not happy about, by the way. Five hole-in-ones you got recently? Yeah. Where was that? Um, Lost City, your kid. <laughs> Are you on the leaderboard there? Yeah, I'm top of the leaderboard. Are you actually? I love that. Six in a row. Six shots in a row, yeah. If you get two, Poppy gets the sticker book. Good bend in the knees, Jolie. It's your posture there. It's because you got your platforms on. <laughs> oh. Just head for the water. Oh. This flag. Just going to take responsibility for that one. Yeah. Was my technique there? Ah, oh, right. So you've got three, three more, to go. Three more chances. Oh, so I need, I need to start putting them in. Yeah. <laughs> this is an interesting technique. Uh, well, the other one wasn't working. This your third. Hold on, one. It lost Sydney. <laughs> <laughs> my quads are crumping. Mm. Yes, there it is. Oh. Oh. Short. Oh. Oh. Got one more. One more. Shot. I think you're playing great, to be honest. <laughs> this is way harder than it looks, by the way. Oh wow, that's yeah. way back the golf hole in six. Nothing. Per per performance. Woo! Oh, too safe. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh! Should we roll that? I think it's the. This is your fourth one, yeah. Oh! Oh! oh. There's definitely a roll in that, I think. Yeah, there is. Okay, Nadine, because this is your last shot, if you get this in, we're going to give all the fans all the prizes. Happy no days. Pressure. Pressures for Taj. Oh, <gasps> yeah! 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 Poppy, Miley well and Bobby, well these guys are headed to you. Well done, Nadine. There you go, Miley and Bobby. <laughs> you are on the leaderboard with one point. <laughs> well, like, I'm sorry, you're on there. <laughs> I come back later in the week for another go. Thanks for joining us on We're On Our Way at the Euros. We hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget, you can enter our competition to win a Euros shirt signed by all of our guests. All you have to do is visit www.irishfa.com forward slash a new dream. For now, though, it's time for the team to take on Norway. We'll see you at St Mary's. We're changing the game. We're making history. This is our dream. A new dream, an unstoppable movement. Now you can see us, you can be us. Watch us rise. We've got what it takes and we always give our all. We battle with passion for every ball. And we're only just getting started.